What's going on YouTube? It's your boy J. Luke here back again with another fire sneaker review. Today what we have here is the Yeezy 500 Soft Vision. But before we get into this video, I need you guys to hit that like and subscribe button for me please. But without a further ado, we have by far in my opinion and I'm sure in everyone else's the best looking 500 colorway to date. Um, usually we're used to getting the bone, the blushes, you know, all of those colorways that are just the same monotone off-white, white colorways, things like that. This one, still a little monotone, but I think this one pops a little bit harder. We got the lavender colorway, it looks like here. It's nice pinkish, purplish, you know, Yeezy, and I think that's very unique, very eye-grabbing. Um, and then to go along with that colorway, I mean, look at the gum bottoms. I'm always sold on the gum bottoms, but with this one here, man, I just think it's a nice colorway. But looking here at the toe box, Nice long hair suede as they do on all the other Yeezys. Um, even the eyelets here, just long hair suede, very, very soft. And I've always liked how they've added these mesh bubbles here. I thought it was a nice, unique, futuristic vibe to it, especially going along here with the midsole. It just looks awesome. But, you know, with this colorway here, man, I think this is definitely one of those that, you know, you should have in the collection if you enjoy 500s. Um, you know, a lot of people might be like, oh, it's not masculine enough for me or whatever. But I think this is going to make an outfit pop, man. Like, I think this is just a nice, subtle flex, very cool looking shoe. Um, comfort wise, you know, I got to give it about an eight. I think this shoe is just one of those shoes that not quite as comfortable as the 350s. But I think these are slept on just because it's more dad shoe vibe. But this color right here, I think, you know, is going to start to kind of elevate it into the future a little bit more. Um, just kind of give it more of a unique futuristic vibe to it. Um, if you have your chance to, you know, get your hands on a pair of these shoes here, I would definitely do so. Um, you know, the value for these is kind of fluctuating to and from, um, especially with them kind of gravitating more towards the 500 highs, which I'm not really a huge fan of. And there's so many other easy colorways coming out that this one kind of like, you know, got slept on, slept on just a little bit, excuse me, but you know, when it came time to the actual release, it was very hard to get your hands on a pair. Um, overall, I think these are going for about 300 or so brand new. I managed to get my hands on a pair for, you know, close to retail, which was a blessing in itself. But, you know, if you have your chance to, you know, get your hands on a pair of these shoes, definitely do so. If you get your hands on a pair of 500, you know what I mean? They're very comfortable. Definitely something you want to have in the collection. But I appreciate you guys for viewing. 